Inyo pong napapanood ang unang araw ng second round of eliminations ng Season 91 ng NCAA. At syempre, patuloy pa rin ang ating Smile Your On Camp segment featuring ang ating mga fans na nanuno dito ng live sa arena sa Luxod ng San Juan. But if you're watching at home, no problem. Thank you so much for joining us. By the way, we'd like to greet uh, one of our colleagues sa ABS-CBN Sports, Laura Liman, watching right now. Hello, Lau. At uh, hirit ni Lau, uh, hi daw, kay Mickey Mirabueno at kay Larry Deang. Ang galing-galing niyo daw po. Nagpapatuloy ang ating bakbakan dito. San Sebastian contra Letran and interestingly in the first quarter coach Olsen 10 different nights scored and pinapakita lang yun yung balance dito sa lineup ng uh, Letran of course an another uh, stat you know uh, 7-0 ang Letran after leading in the first quarter so in the sa first round 7-0 sila after leading the first quarter Mark Cruz Finally getting on the board via his first field goal. Ito na ang pinakamalaking kalamangan para sa Letra. 26 to 15 inside pass. Ginto, supalpal sa likod, pero sumabit si Balanza. Balikan natin ngayon si Erica Rabar. Yes, magdaon ngayon kasama ko si Mr. Roddy Vesalidis, ang membro ng Sun, ng Five Beat Sun Sebastian team noong 1993 to 1997. Hello, sir. Ano po yung pinaka miss nyo dito sa NCAA? Ah, marami ako namimiss, lalo na yung crowd, yung mga drums, yung mga students na pag sumusuporta every game namin dito sa, 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 sa NCAA. Nakaka-miss naman po talaga yung crowd, lalo na po yung suporta ng mga tao. Ano naman po, ngayong lamang po ang letran, ano naman po yung mabibigay niyong advice sa San Sebastian? Uh, sa ngayon, sa nakikita ko, concern ko, kailangan yung transition offense nila, ma-perfect nila. Kasi sa fast break, nag-full court yung letran, so kailangan ma-break nila yun. And box out sa defense. At ayun nga, so Sir Rolly de Pasilides, balik sa'yo, Anton. Maraming salamat, Erica. Yes, he, uh, one of the high flyers of uh, San Sebastian before. Nakasama rin niya sila Romel Adukol. Mm -hmm. At member din ng champion team ng San Sebastian yan, si Rolly Basilides. At syempre, mga teammates niya. Ngayon, mga miyembro ng coaching staff, Rodney Santos, Bubuy Tanige, at Banjo Calpito. Mga miyembro ng unang five feet sa kasaysayan ng NCAA from 1993 to 1997. Bullet pa sa ilalim. Wala na rin unable to finish at may foul na naman sa ilalim. Talagang uh, pisikal ang ating bakbakan dito sa pagitan ng Knights at Golden Stags. Let's take a look at what happened here dito sa last sequence na ito. Ang unang field goal ni the Ant-Man sa ating labat. Master Guapo move of the corner. Watch out for more Guapo moves powered by Master Secreto ng mga Guapo. Kanina nakita natin a missed opportunity for San Sebastian dun sa fast break na two against one. Yes. Those are the kinds of ano, opportunities na hindi pwedeng uh, pakawala ng San Sebastian. Especially in a game like this against the Tran Knights. I've never heard this before, Coach Olsen. Hear it ni Margo. Don't just bring home the bacon. Bring home the whole pit. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Keep sending in your tweets. And include your support para sa inyong mga eskwelahan. Hashtag galing CSJL. Ayan ang ating bagong hashtag ngayon ha. If you're from Letran, hashtag galing CSJL. Thank you very much, Margo, for that tweet. We encourage everybody to be creative with your tweets also. Nakakatuwa eh. Samantala, Costello, stop and pop jumper. Wala. Two on one fast break situation para sa Knights. Gito for the end man. Ito mo yung comparison doon Anton. Twice ito San Sebastian had the numbers. Pero itong uh, Letran ang uh, nakashoot pa doon sa kabilang end. Sa kabilang panic naman, Michael Kalisaan. That's his favorite spot underneath the basket. Balikan natin itong fast break. Coach Olsen, fast play of the game. Brought to you by Smart Live the Smart Life. It was the end man. I think that was his fourth point of the game, giving this 10-point lead to the Letran Knights. 
the last last time out when they these teams played each other maganda rin ginawa ng uh, San Sebastian was their zone defense at uh, so far dito second quarter pinakita na nila itong zone defense but kagaya ng sinabi mo nakaraan na ang first round eh handa na rin ang veteran dahil alam nila na hirapan sila doon sa zone defense nila ng first round eh pinaghanda naman niya ni coach Alden Ayo and also the zone defense coach Olsen kind of backfired dahil that opened the three-point shooters for the Letran Knights. Well, not just the three-point uh, shooting, yes, of Letran Knights, na isang weapon nila, but of course, offensive rebounding ang uh, naibibigay mo when you play zone defense. Ngayon naman, San Sebastian giving the Knights a taste of their own medicine, forcing a turnover and converting. Mga bagong defensive strategies. Yan ang ipapakita ng bawat kumunan dito sa second round. Season 91 ng NCAA. Balanza, tumira sa labas. Bitin. Rebound ng bata. Pero may tulakan na nangyari sa ilalim. Pakalawang foul na yan ni Jeric Fabian. And again, another offensive rebound off that uh, missed three-pointer by Letran. 28-22. Letran on top. Mark Rose. Shadow mataas para kay Kevin Rakal. Di ko monekta. At dalawang veteran of nights sa offensive sequence na yun. Now my question to you a while ago, Coach Olsen, will the Letran Knights or the players who have been drafted still play Serious dito sa season 91. Kitang kita naman. Todo bigay pa rin si Rakal, Cruz at Quinto dito sa laban na to. Now with Cruz and Rakal set to graduate, he is the future, Coach O. Yes, Ray ng bata. Uh, he has improved a lot from last season. Especially with his outside shooting. Napakaganda na outside shooting ni uh, Ray Nambatak in his last game. Naka-anim na three-point shots to <laughs> see uh, Ray Nambatak. So very improved the player right now. Talking about Ray Nambatak, nagpapabati yan eh. It's the birthday of his dad today. Wow! Uh, si si uh, Ray Nambatak Sr. who hails from uh, Cogian de Oro. Happy birthday, sir. We have a lot of great players Dito sa season 91 ng NCAA hailing from Cagayan de Oro. And it's nice to see one of them here in the Letran Knights squad for season 91. Cross-court pass, Rakal, nakuha ang bola, top of the key, using the Soliano screen. Quinto, naghanap ng makampi, decides to drive. Naagawan! Ryan Costello. Inside pass, Kalisan, natapik ni Soliano ang bola. Ito na si Cruz, pinasakay ng Batak. Ng Batak, dere-derecho para sa fast break layup. Very impressive talaga itong fast break ng uh, Letran. Ano? Dami nila opportunities and really very efficient, especially in the fast break. Number four team, pagdating sa fast break points, Colegio de San Juan de Letran. The Ant-Man to Ray Nambatak Labak and Knights Pretty faces watching live Dito, si, dito sa arena Sa lungsod ng San Juan And thank you also to everybody watching Wherever you are Whether you're watching on ABS-CBN Sports in Action Or on Balls, High Definition Sky Cable Channel 167 Or all over the world via the Filipino channel Maraming maraming salamat po And we'd like to take this opportunity To greet our production manager From ABS-CBN Sports Happy, happy birthday Miss Jenny Jimenez Happy birthday Miss Jen Yes, happy birthday, Tita Jenny. 
Maraming uh, may birthday sa ABS-CBN Sports uh, this month, Coach Olsen, last Oo, week. Lalo, lalo na sa Friday. <laughs> last week si Coach AG, <laughs> earlier Coach Jude, today Miss Jenny. And on Friday, of course, Mr. Anton Rojas will be celebrating his uh, 29th birthday. Yes, that's right. right. Uh, some of the courtside reporters can call me Kuya Anton now. <laughs> I don't mind. Sabi ni Mela... Nagmadali pa ako umuwi from school for your game stags. Win. Hashtag galing SSCR. Mela, you got it right. You got the hashtag right. This is what we're doing. Sa simulan ng second round. Thank you so much for your tweets. We'd like to invite everybody also to tweet. Show your support for your school. We will show them live here sa ating ABS-CBN sports coverage all throughout the second round. Si Coach Rodney going to his bench really. Ngayon naman si pinasok na si Bragais for the first time in today's game. Ryan Costello, three points and two rebounds so far dito sa lapan na to. Napaka-importante nitong uh, larong ito para sa San Sebastian knowing that they're 2-7 right now and we're already in the second round. We've got to start making waves and catching up sa mga kumunan na 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 is makapasok sa Final Four. Kevin Rakal. So interestingly, wala pang kumokonekta dito sa three points sa laban na to, Coach Olsen. So, oh, especially for uh, Letran, that's why to San Sebastian, they actually change up the defense, going from their uh, zone defense to man-to-man. -man, na medyo naguguluhan ngayon itong Letran. Montek na pumasok yung tirang yon para kay Ray ng bata. That was the most open three-pointer that he took today. K-Rax umatake over Bradwin Ginto. At babalik sa free throw line si Kevin Rakal. And that's the way to do it. Ano? Pag kalaban mo, mas malaki sa'yo. You take it strong to the basket. As you see in this low mo, alam ni Rakal na mas malaki sa kanya si Gito. He takes it strong to the basket against a shot blocker like Gito. At uh, nakakuha siya ng fall doon. Kevin Rakal will be reunited in the pros with his former college coach, Louis Alas. The first coach he played for when he first entered the NCAA. And uh, I'm pretty sure kaya naman uh, din raft ito uh, ng uh, koponan ni Coach uh, Louie Alas uh, pros is because very familiar siya sa laro ni uh, Kevin Rakal. At ang koponan ni Kevin Rakal ngayon, lamang 32-27 or Tuesday. Pinasa kay Gito ang bola. Ay tawid nila sa half court. Under five minutes to go here in the first half. Na agaw ni Soliano ang bola. Ito na si Mark Cruz. Cruz, pinasa sa kanto. Louis for three. First three-pointer of the game. Courtesy of Macchor Louis. Yun na hinihintay mo, Anton. No, no? First three-pointer of the game. And that corner is very vulnerable para dito sa... San Sebastian Stags because ang nandun na bumabantay dun sa court na yun is Bradwin Ginto a much bigger opponent at ito si Luit mas lamang sa quickness kaya nahuli dun si Bradwin Ginto Letran is really a three-point shooting team looking at the numbers 75 made three-pointers in the first round that's the most number of made threes by any team in the NCAA at most attempts then ang Letran, ha? 246 attempts. It's a very dangerous combination, ano? And three-point shooting, saka yung running game. Even in, even during the fast break, eh, pag libre yung mga yan, talagang uh, tinitira agad nila. You have uh, Nambatak there, you have uh, Cruz, and uh, Rakal din. Nakahanap ng formula si Coach Alden Ayo para hindi mapansin yung kanilang lack of height. They're hiding that lack of height using defense and outside shooting. In and out on that triple by Nambata. Cross-court pass. Pula na di bubbles the basketball at babalik sa letra ng bola. Dami ng missed opportunities nito San Sebastian. 
Uh, they're doing the right thing. Ang problema kung paano nila gagawin yun, ano? Kanina, during sets, gusto nila puntahan si Ginto. Pero hindi nila mapuntahan because of turnovers. Magandang depensa rin kasi ang pinapakita ng uh, Letran Knights. They've been going full court. Man to man all the way so far dito sa laban na to. And this address ni Cruz. Kevin Rakal fade away. Wala pa rin. Soliano, Fumi, Tumira, wala pa rin. Pero mananatili ang bola sa panic ng Letran. Grabe rin itong offensive rebound ng Letran. Malaking lineup na ito nasa loob for San Sebastian. Ha? You have Bacalisaan, Ginto, and Bulanadi in there. Inside pass. Natapek na agaw ng San Sebastian. Ortoste with a finish. Finally, they get something of that uh, fast break. So easy layup by Jamil Ortoste. Ortoste now with five points dito sa laban na ito. Rakal, pinasa kay Luib. Ng bata. Hops inside. Rakal, hindi na basang bola. Soliano, three in the key. Tinawag kay Rakal. Again, in change-up ng depensa ni Coach Rodney from man to zone, medyo gumugulo dito sa Letran Knights. Imagine, ha, lima lang tong lamang ng uh, Letran ngayon ng ton. Ano? Tapos ang dami ng turnovers na nakukumit sa Sebastian. So kung naiba, maiba pa lang nila yung turnovers nila, be very good uh, close game. Baka lamang pa sila. 11 turnovers na nakumit ng San Sebastian. Make that 12. And the Atman going all the way for the fast break layup. 7 points for Mark Cruz. Ang problema, Anton, eh, after a turnover, nakakonvert pa itong uh, Letran. Sometimes after the turnover, eh, pwede mo na ma-stop yun by sprinting back. But ang nangyayari ngayon, eh, easy 2 points ang Letran because of those turnovers committed by San Sebastian. San Sebastian slowly succumbing to the pressure kasi nung unang bahagi ng first quarter nabibreak pa nila eh, yung press ng Letran Kalisan, that's what he does best abangero yan eh, si Kalisan sa ilalim doon siya nag-operate sa ilalim uh, he's a good finisher underneath at uh, pretty nice uh, jump shot also for a big man pero yun, kagaya yung sinama doon siya nag-operate sa ilalim a 35 points yan si Kalisa, the second highest output in the first round. Pero ngayon, ang kanyang kumpanan down 37 to 32. Magbabalik po ang NCAA Season 91 ilabas. Ang galing. Nagbabalik po ang Season 91 ng NCAA. Malapit na tayo makarating sa halftime at upang malaman nating lahat kung ano ang mangyayari doon, punta natin si Erica Rabara. Erica? Yes, Anton, sa mga fans nga ni Mark Rakal at sa mga kapamilya nating may gusto pang malaman tungkol sa ating letran, veteran, abangan ninyo ang 24 Seconds with Kevin Rakal, mamaya yan at lahat. Talk to you, Anton. Go Chosen! Maraming salamat, Erica. Exacto, Kevin Rakal. Dana pumunta sa professional ranks pero bago yan, last ride muna. Last battle kasama ang kanyang mga letranista, the Knights, dito sa Season 91 ng NCAA. Abang natin yan sa halftime. Ito yung adjustment ni Coach Rodney. Back-to-back turnover for San Sebastian. Because of that press ng Letran, ipinasok ni Coach Rodney ngayon si Ryan Costello who is uh, doing a good job controlling itong uh, offense itong uh, San Sebastian. Sa bantala, Soliano, the silent operator para sa Letran Knights. Nakapuntos na. Parang siya 4 points dito sa larong ito. Panoorin natin muli na recover eh, ni Soliano ang bola. Napakasimple. One fake, pull up, strong move. Brought to you by Smart Live the Smart Life. Ginto, sinagasaan ng depensa. 
Bitin nga lang ang kanyang tira. Ginto has cooled off after a strong start, Coach Olsen. Yes, uh, so far, nahihirapan na ngayon San Sebastian. It's a torrid shooting ng Letran. But ito, eh, they have the numbers again. Ortuste. Niluwa ang bola. Pero mananatili sa San Sebastian ang possession. Kanina pa pa binabanggit yun ito. Yung mga missed opportunities. Three against two. Two against one. Na dapat eh, easy points na yun for San Sebastian. But despite all those missed opportunities, Coach Olsen, they're only down by seven. Yun nga eh. Diba imagine mo if they convert on those uh, fast breaks, if they cut down on their turnovers. And if they make their free throws. Itong Letran, 11 points off turnovers. Bulanadi, on your screens a while ago. Seven points for Bulanadi dito sa larong ito. Actually, a good performance for him. They need other players to step up. Aside from the first five, talking about the team of Coach Rodney Santos. Importante mga bench players para dito sa Sebastian. Binanggit natin yun uh, kanina sa pag-umstupisa uh, ng uh, laro natin. Kailangan talaga mag-step up yung bench players ni Coach Rodney. Ayun na nga si Bularadi. Let's uh, step up ngayong araw sa second round. First day of the second round of eliminations ng men's basketball tournament. Ito na. San Sebastian, umarangkada, Ortoste. Naghanap ng foul, walang tinawag. So si Jamil Ortuse, maganda linaro last game. Diyan sabi na, but so far in this game, really struggling si Jamil Ortuste. Just five points for Jamil Ortuste. Two out of five from the field. Nabitawa ni Calvo ang bola, wrong pass. Another turnover for Letran. At alam mo, kung ang San Sebastian merong labing tatlong turnovers, Letran also not keeping the basketball well. 11 turnovers for the Knights. Calvo, Dosoliano, another turnover. Ito na Golden Stags. Fabian, huminto, umatake. Lumea, paso. Good job by Fabian. Ito, attacking the basket, getting that two points. So, ito mo, hanging around lang itong uh, San Sebastian right now. Apat lang itong hinahabol nila. Alam mo, Coach Olsen, parang may similarities eh, sa nangyari sa unang pagtatagpo ng dalawang kubunan na ito kasi hanging around rin eh, yung Golden Stats in that first round meeting. Pero ang question nga doon, Anton, if they could sustain this for the whole 40 minutes. And that's the problem when you don't have a solid bench. It's very hard to sustain the same level of play. 39.8 seconds na lang ang nalalabi dito sa ating first half. Costello. Babalik sa free throw line para sa kumunan ni Coach Rodney Santos. Costello also a former San Sebastian Stanglet teammate ni Michael Calisan. Second free throw is good for Costello, who now has five. I remember in that game against uh, Letran, ito si Costello, I think, fouled out of the game. Kaya nahirapan sila dun sa crucial stretches of that game. But ito si Costello really doing a good job of the directing plays and breaking that press of Letran. Rakal, pinasa kay Luib. Apreku. Pitin. Costello, pinasa kay Ortoste. Ortoste gets the basket. Ngayon, dalawa na lang itong hinahabol nila. Good job by San Sebastian, keeping the game close. And Costello wisely giving up a foul para ma-set up ng San Sebastian ang kanilang depensa. That's only the third team foul ngayong quarter. They can give up one more kung gusto nila. Pero nalibre si Calvo. Bitin ang kanyang dress. Huling pakakatot para sa San Sebastian or Tuesday eh, for the lead. Bitin. What a battle. Dito sa ating pangalawang laban 
So unang araw ng second round of eliminations ng Season 91 ng NCAA, we saw some great plays on the fast break in particular. Antman with a finish. Jeric Fabian with a drop pass to Costello. And Mark Cruz feeding McJoy Lewip for the first and only made three-pointer in the game so far. Two points separating the two teams. 41-39. Lamang ang Knights contra sa Stags. Halftime. Susunod na.